Welcome to eLearning Modules for the WebStat. This is module number three, and in this module, we'll be discussing how to add special events to your WebStat. These can be especially useful at times like state conference or general conference, or maybe you have a funeral at the end of the week, and you want to occupy the building on a day that is not typically occupied. In order to get there, click on the Schedules tab. Once you reach the Schedules tab, you'll notice that you have multiple schedules. Click on the one that you want to alter. Once you reach the schedule itself, you'll notice that there are three tabs across the top. Choose Special Events. You'll be able to observe that I've already added two special events. One is for April Conference, the other one's for October Conference. Let's look at one of them just to observe how it's set up. First of all, we give it a name. We give it a week and a day choice. You can choose a date, a range, or a week and day. We want to choose every Sunday, first week in April, as the uh, general conference schedule. And then we're telling it that at 12 a.m. and then 11.59 p.m. that it needs to be unoccupied. Typically, the building's occupied between 7 and 4 p.m. in the afternoon. But in this case, we're overriding that time by saying it's going to be unoccupied the whole day. But what about state conference? Let's just say that we have a state conference this weekend on Saturday night. Let's go ahead and add a new event. We'll call this state conference. We'll want to choose, this is just going to be a date. It's not going to be a range or a weekend day. It's just going to be the one shot deal. We want to choose this Saturday. It's going to be the 9th of January, 2016. The meeting is going to start at 7, so why not bring it on at 6.30. And then it's going to end at 9.30, but let's keep it till 10, because people will probably linger around for a while. Instead of being unoccupied, the building is already unoccupied on Saturday, but we want to make it occupied. So now we hit OK. And once it's saved, it's going to show up on our list here also want to come down here and hit save at the bottom. After you save it, it's going to bring you back to the main screen for that schedule. But let's consider another option, the cultural hall. Do we want that to be on during general conference? Let's find out if it has a special event. Let's click on that schedule now. All right, now we're in that schedule. Let's click on special events. All right, it doesn't have any special events associated with it. So what we can do now is we can copy from Sunday schedule. And that just brought over all three schedules that we set up already over into the cultural hall. The thing is, since it's a state conference, we're only going to be using the chapel. So let's just go ahead and delete that one out of there. Delete and save. Give it a minute to update. And now this building has been set up with special events.